If Full Collectors is Gemini Just for Life, and I will be doing a review on the Gemini Max C17. Very nice model. I've always wanted this model for a while. I finally got it. Um, with so many Gemini Just releases um, and models that they had, I just had to keep putting it off because there was models that I really liked. So I just had to put that one off, but I finally got it. And it's the Boeing C-17 Globemaster 3. It's a limited edition, I guess, what it says. Dover Air Force Base. That's where this aircraft came from. Um, so without further ado, let's look at the box. Tells you all the information about this. Plane. Oh, let's go down. Okay. There we go. Tells you all the information about this plane. Pause if you would like to read. And pause if you would like to read that also. That. Size and everything. So, let's get to the model. So right there you have your um your door uh, and your cockpit will focus okay oh uh, going back out come on now All right, there we go. Okay, there goes the cockpit, U.S. Air Force Base, and all of those um, letters and numbers Ooh, there. Anyway, you have your pedal tubes right there. Right there, you have your pedal tubes. I have like a there's a door thing right by above the nose gear. Then you have your door, which is like fairly to the bottom. Okay. Then you have your engines, um, your winglet, the red beacon, and your wing, the flaps and aileron detail on it and everything. Up here. Focus, but you can see that little black vent thing right there. Hopefully, yeah, there it goes. Okay, little black vent thing right there. Um, this plane has pretty good mount detail. I'm really excited and glad that I got this model. Then it goes the wheels, the main gear. Um, and right there, have another door. Rear door. More focus. All right, there we go. There goes the rear door. Um, there goes some more of the little doors up at the top. And have your military sign, your tail with the cool um, beacon light feature. This is very realistic. And I, um, have your AMC American sign over the back. To the other side. Let's close um. Okay. Have basically the same thing, except for this door is smaller than the other one on the other side. Have your engines. Um. But on this side, it has like a big silver thing with a hole. I think that's um for gas. I guess when it's on the ground. 
Um, and you have your landing gear, your door, and all of that good stuff. And at the top, you have that, and I think, I think that, let me see. It's up five minutes into this. I'm so sorry, guys. Uh, um, have your little square thing right there. It's in the like yellow thing. I think that's for the fuel when it's in the air. Anyway, have your top. Very nice. And then you have your bottom. Have your nose gear. Look at all that detail. Um, it's a very thick model. I really like this. And if you caught the, those, the like mold kind of, I guess you can call it. Um, it's not even. That's really how the real plane is. Because that one is a side that has like the big silver fuel thing. So it needs to be longer. And right here, you can open up the doors um, so it can let cars in. Let's see. So, but when I say, hold on, guys. All right, sorry I had to do that, but mine doesn't go down all the way. A second one. Hold on again. See, it only goes to right there. My other one, it will focus. Jeez, I'm running on 10 minutes with this. Focus. All right, well, I can't really, it's not focusing, so I have to hurry up with this for you. And, um, yeah, well, that's it for the model. Sorry, guys, that my camera was acting up today. Um. But thank you, like, and subscribe if you haven't already. This is Gemini Just for Life. Bye.